From Scripture, these words of assurance and grace. I will restore you to health and heal your wounds. I will renew you and have compassion on your homes. From my people will come songs of thanksgiving and the sound of rejoicing. Loving God, look upon us with your eyes of mercy and comfort us with your healing grace. We place our hope alone in your everlasting faithfulness and eternal compassion. We believe your promises of restoration and boldly claim this word of truth over our brokenness. Heal us, Lord, and we will be healed. Save us, and we will be saved. For you are the one we praise. Oh, you 
The people walking in darkness have seen a great light. On those living in the land of the shadow of death, a light has dawned. For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government will be upon his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, and the Prince of Peace. O Lord, our night is deep. We choose shadows and hide from the light of your dawn. Forgive our fragile faith and grant us eyes to see your glory in every simple joy. Help us to rise from our despair and claim the promise of abundant life. Restore to us the joy of your salvation. <laughs> Oh, mm -hmm. 
In the sixth month of Elizabeth's pregnancy, God sent the angel Gabriel to Nazareth, a town in Galilee, to a virgin pledged to be married to a man named Joseph, a descendant of David. The virgin's name was Mary. The angel went to her and said, Greetings, you who are highly favored. The Lord is with you. Mary was greatly troubled at his words and wondered what kind of greeting this might be. But the angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary. You have found favor with God. You will conceive and give birth to a son, and you are to call him Jesus. O oh Lord, help us to believe your miracles of grace. Open our eyes that we may see. Open our ears that we may hear. Open our mouths that we may share your story with all. Come, graceful rose, we wait for you. Awake our song, our joy renew. Come to
So Joseph also went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea to Bethlehem. He went there to register with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him and was expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cloths and placed him in a manger because there was no guest room available for them. Lord, as we gaze upon the manger, may we remember your simple birth and the great mystery of your incarnation. Just as you were born to us this holy night, may we be born again in you. Surround us with your grace and decorate our lives with hope, peace, love and joy. And there were shepherds living out in the fields nearby, keeping watch over their flocks at night. An angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will cause great joy for all the people. Today, in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. 
Suddenly, a great company of the heavenly host appeared with the angel, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven, and on earth peace to those on whom his favor rests. Lord, thank you for the gift of praise. May we boldly proclaim your birth with the music of our worship. We are reminded how on that first Christmas, many missed the singing of the angels. May our hearts be quickened and alert, always listening for your song of grace in the night. May we listen, learn, and live. Now after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, in the days of Herod the king, behold, wise men came from the east to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who has been born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east, and have come to worship him. As they went their way, the star they had seen in the east went before them until it stopped over the place where the child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceedingly great joy. Lead us, Lord, with your star of wonder. Take us past the deserts of our wandering. Carry us beyond the mountains that stand between us and our divine destinations. Grant us wisdom to always follow your light. And may we find our true purpose in bringing our gifts of praise before you. Thank you. 
In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was with God in the beginning. Through Him all things were made. Without Him nothing was made that has been made. In Him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. And this is the good news of the gospel. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. are brightly shining. It is the night of the dear Savior's birth. Long lay the world in sin and error pining till he appeared and the soul felt its Oh, 